Let's see if we can get the poem in. I'll be happy to go out and read the, the poem. Notice the procession, notice the bagpipe, drums, horns, notice high silk high crowns and saffron robes, notice the three-piece suits, I notice the crowds quiet, I notice the Chilean poet, noticed a rainbow, I noticed the guru was dead, I noticed the teacher bare-breasted, watching the corpse burn in the stupa. Noticed morning students sat cross-legged before their books, chanting devotional mantras, gesturing mysterious fingers, bells and brass, thunderbolts in their hands. I noticed flames rising above flags and wires and umbrellas and painted orange poles. I noticed, I noticed the sky, I noticed the sun, a rainbow around the sun, light misty clouds drifting over the sun. I noticed my own heart beating, breath passing through my nostrils, my feet walking, I sing. I noticed smoke above the corpse. I noticed fired monuments. I noticed the path downhill. I noticed the crowd moving toward the buses. I noticed food and lettuce salad. And I noticed the teacher was absent. And I noticed my friends. And I noticed my car. And I noticed the blue vulva. And I noticed a young boy held my hand. Our key in the motel door I noticed a dark room and I noticed a dream and forgot noticed oranges lemons and caviar and breakfast I noticed the highway sleepiness homework thoughts the boys nipple chest in the breeze as the cars rolled down hillsides and past green woods to the water I noticed the houses and the balconies overlooking a misted horizon shore and old worn rocks in the sand I noticed the sea, I noticed the music, I wanted to dance. And so we said goodbye to Allen Ginsberg, who once called Gregory Corso, the most elegant and irreverent of the beat poets. He was our guide through the mystical labyrinth of language. When he died, he was buried in Rome at the feet of the poet Shelley, whom he loved. I remember once being in a small church with him looking at a crucifix. There was a skull at the feet of Christ in the phrase, memento mori. Remember, you are mortal, said Gregory, but poetry is not. And I 